MTCR missile technology control regime boost to Indian missile technology to a next level. India has successfully tested a Brahmos cruise missile with an extended range of 450 kilometers. Because of the restrictive missile technology control regime, MTCR, the cruise missile that was developed with Russian collaboration had a maximum range of 290 km, as export of missiles having a range of more than 300 km was prohibited under MTCR rules. In June 2016, Foreign Secretary S. Shankar signed the instrument of accession to the 34-member MTCR which is the first multilateral export control regime that opens its door for New Delhi. The Brahmos missile was successfully tested on Saturday, within nine months of the accession being inked, from the integrated test range at Chandipuradishka. The formidable missile system once again proved its mettle to precisely hit enemy targets at much higher range than the current range of 290 km with the supersonic speed of 2.8 Mach. The land attack version of the missile met its mission parameters, Brahmos Aerospace said in a statement. Senior Army officials witnessed the launch. With the successful test firing of Brahmo's extended range, Indian armed forces will be empowered to knock down enemy targets far beyond 450 km, said Sada Misra, chief executive officer and managing director of Brahmo's Aerospace. The first announcement on the new Brahmos was made by the DRDO Director General S. Christopher at the Aero India 2017 last month. India successfully tested the extended range variant of the supersonic Brahmos cruise missile from the integrated test range at Chandipur, Adishka. The strike range was enhanced from 290 km to 450 km. Officials called it a textbook launch executed with high precision. India's successful membership to the missile technology control regime has removed all caps on missile test ranges. Defence Minister Parkar expressed India's willingness to export Akash and Brahmos missile systems along with Tejas fighter jets after Indian Air Force's needs are met. India and Russia had agreed to export Brahmos to Vietnam, UAE, South Africa and Chile in principle. Clearance was expected to be given for exporting about 10% of the total missile systems and Tejas aircraft manufactured. India on stronger footing in China dealings. India strengthened efforts to export Brahmos to Vietnam. Jeff Smith, Asian Security Programs Director U.S. Foreign Policy Council, stated that by strengthening its defense ties with Japan, U.S., and Vietnam, India put itself on stronger footing in its China dealings. Thank you for watching. Please like, share, comment, and subscribe.